Yeah, yeah, we do, man. It's natural yeah. to us, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey. This shit not scripted, man. Real life. That's what's up, though. So, so what, what was that track, man? What was that track we just heard, man? It basically was just like a freestyle. What? It's the 24 hours. You, you freestyled it 24 hours ago? Everything. Everything. Off the top, man. Everything coming off the top. Yeah. 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 Man, so what what state of mind was you in like when, when you recorded it, man? It sounded like you were just a vibe within yourself. I it really was, you know what I'm saying? But it's just like certain melodies, it, it, it'll take you out of space so last night. It, 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 it different triggers. I went out of space. Yeah. yeah. So you, you took a trip, man. Quick trip. Quick trip, man. Quick trip. Where you talking to get motherfucking gas station, man? Yeah. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. Murder, yeah. though, man. Yeah. <laughs> we know this shit don't have it quick, man. Yeah. I think gotta put some work in So so how long how long you been uh rapping, man? Like, you know what I'm saying? You you ATI, like, get this started like when y'all were young or like how did that come about? Man. I've been I've been rapping forever. Rapping for you know what I'm saying? But uh ATI, like ATI didn't even come about. I wasn't even in the city, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I so it's something hap- it's something happening like the college college or something? Like- it was college. Okay, it was college. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha, it, gotcha. Hey, but it at first at first, didn't nobody catch on. Mm-hmm. Dang, they, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people couldn't even get past the meme. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, man, I know like, we've been holding this shit down right here since. For sure, man, I see y'all moving, man. I like, I like y'all sound. You know what I'm saying? Definitely, y'all, y'all know GMT definitely rock with ATI, man. Like, family, like, yeah. Yeah, man. Uh, what what kind of projects you working on? Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't hear a lot. I don't hear a lot of your stuff on online on the internet, man. I know you got a whole arsenal. You probably sitting on, man. Like, man, let the people know what you what got, you got planned, what you working on. I got I got a couple of tapes put together. You know, have you dropped them yet, or you, they put I together? Ain't, I ain't dropped none yet. I put they put together though. They put I mean, together. What, what you what you waiting on? Man, I'ma just say the wait is over. Ah, uh, so you about to drop. So it just it time will tell, man. You know, sometimes it ain't about, you know, I'm just do it. Mm-hmm. Sometimes it's about to do it right. Yeah. And, and you when know you what say I'm and when you say doing it doing it right, right? Because a lot of times, you know, that's why I be trying to explain to a lot of artists, like, you ain't, it's okay to drop music, right? But ain't no need to keep dropping music and nobody knows who you is, right? And when you 
get ready to drop, you gotta make sure you have that, that bag and that budget ready and together. Because what if you drop a hit, right? What if your album go crazy? The money don't start right off back like that, right? You gotta be able to get to these places and take out work or stop whatever it is that you're doing to go, you know what I'm saying, tap in because opportunity. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and you know, a lot of people, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't happening because they don't have a plan. We was talking about this earlier, about having a plan. So it yeah. sound like you being strategic with it. You know what I'm saying? You got a plan and you wait until when you ready. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? On, on your that's, time. That's really what it's about. You know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta do it when you ready. You know? Yeah. You know, you wanna jump out the porch. You don't wanna be pushed in the back. You feel me? <laughs> For sure. You feel me? So, so, so it's like, when you jump out the porch, you gotta be ready. I dropped one project, Salsa Pine. I feel like, yeah, it's a dope. You know what I'm right. But there's so much transpired within that time. So it was just like, I was moving with the time. Mm, you know trying what I'm to saying? keep up with the time. And then when I realized what it really takes to do this, you, you had to gotta, take a step back. You gotta, yeah, and you gotta learn. And then you gotta watch. You feel me? So it's just like, and at the same time, you gotta have a catalog. You know, who's to say, boom, one take this, boom. And I, I'm, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you that's the hardest part too. <laughs> Having to, you got, you got to learn, right? How to unlearn, True. to relearn. True. You know what I'm saying? True. Learn, learn how to unlearn what you to learn, to relearn. Cause what you thought, what you learned, it probably not been right, or you probably had to, you know what I'm saying? Still take a step back. Like when I got in the industry, I thought the music industry was about talent. But once I got in it, you know what I'm saying, got my foot wet, you realize that it, it's only 10%. You know Everybody what I'm saying? Got talent. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So so what are three things, man, you would tell like, you know, any upcoming artists that's out here that's getting started, you know what I'm saying, to help them avoid the things that, you know what I'm saying, you had to unlearn and relearn. Really just, you know, for one, be true to yourself, master your craft. You know what I'm saying? The, Don't treat the, it like the, a, a hobby. real uncut and raw you may sound better than, you know, the actor or the character. That everybody you know wants you to be you or assume. Yeah. You know. So you gotta you gotta have your own identity. Don't let nobody else put an identity on you. Yeah, yeah. You gotta know who you are. And believe in yourself. You know. You are artist, you gotta be a performer too, you know. So and, and what it, what it, it, it take a lot to stand in front of people and spit your mm-hmm. It take a lot for you to travel and you know, go to this show, go to this city, go to that city, and do this without a deal. You stack your paper, you know what I'm saying? So otherwise, it doesn't matter how cold you are, how many bars, how talented, how good you can sing at the end of the day. If you ain't got that bag, that paper, right? You just wow. gonna be stuck. That too, but you also, you just gotta have, as an artist, you gotta have drive. You really gotta be driven to be creative. Yeah. Like, to really master your craft, you have to have drive to wanna do it continuously. So, you know, you've been, you been sitting back mastering your craft, getting better at what you do, like reaching different levels. Most definitely. And what it's all about, my leveling up, get to the next level. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, I appreciate you for your time. I know I caught y'all guard, but <laughs> just showing people how it's raw, how it's real, real, how authentic this shit is. Yeah, yeah polo pet just walked through, man. Probably got some polo on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. He got his own brand on, my nigga ready for the interview, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but I'ma holler at y'all, man. Uh, nah, tell the people what to uh, tap in with you, man. What to follow you? Man, IG, Facebook. 
anything, everywhere. Go look me up, ATIDs. You already know what's going on, man. Shout out to GMT. Shout out my boy Keynote. Shout out to Pressure Made, man. You already know what's going on. Yes, sir.